Hello my beautiful beauties and my wonderful lovelies. A pleasant morning to each and every person here and I wish you many many blessings. God's richest, choicest, finest, wisest and best certainly in all of your good and your god and godly endeavors. All right my beautiful people, let me see if I let me try and get into it quickly rather. I remember the late great and the esteemed the renowned sister Mary Stephanie. She was our principal when I was in high school at the uh, uh, the 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 best high school in my opinion, um, Holy Childhood High School. I know everybody's gonna say, you know, and th in those days, I mean, I gave a lot of trouble, but that was an excellent high school. And one of the things that I remembered about the late Sister Stephanie, Sister Mary Stephanie, and her name preceded her and uh, preceded her as well in other high schools like Immaculate and Campion, and you know all the wonderful schools that we can think about, not to say other schools are not, please. Um, she was revered, she was respected, she was honored because she commanded respect. Are you aware that you can command respect? Yes, you can. You can. Her words matched her deeds. I don't know what she did behind closed doors. That's not my, for me to take on. That's God's job. In fact, everything really belongs to God. But in terms of what she emitted to the students, she was grace. She was class. I told somebody that once I heard her said, say something in Patwa, and that was the word Niam. We were, we were floored as students. We were discombobulated. <laughs> we were frightened. We're like, oh my God, after all these years, she commanded respect. I gave a lot of trouble. I mean, I really did. And but she was one person that I really could say I I don't think I've ever given her any mischief or trouble. I I know I was not to her disrespectful. If she passed by and she said good morning, ladies, we answered with respect. If she said, ladies, I ask that you remove from here and you go over there, we moved. Yes, she commanded respect. And she was not loud. She never had to shout. She never had to get boisterous vulgar or raucous no she commanded respect because her words her words matched her deed we knew that if she called you in her office you better pray that god comes down and change her mind because it's either of two things either you're going to be suspended depending on the nature of the act or you're going to be expelled she didn't play she did not play she commanded respect and she was a disciplinarian you too can command respect all right, know what to let in, know what to not let in. Follow me on TikTok, subscribe to my YouTube channel, share this. Have a wonderful morning.